Hi, Brennan. Um, <clears throat> so, I'm working on basically this, this series of inventions uh, and uh, policy theory that all basically all work together. This unified social theory, uh, conserving energy, uh, so emotional energy as well as uh, resources and everything. So it's these series of, of inventions, uh, basically the, the vehicle of the future. Uh, and uh, it's basically like navigation systems, structures. So one example is uh, the bathroom of the future. They would use much less water, be this portable structure that uh, brings comfort and efficiency in line. You know, efficiency is very important uh, energy-wise and everything like that. But comfort is actually a little, believe it or not, you know, Ripley's Iron Maiden, not the most comfortable thing. But architecture and culture, society, all basically work together. Um, because of you know, structures, both phys physical structures as well as social ecology structures, uh, responsibility, but also uh, navigation, direction. Uh, and so basically, you start with theory. And you start with the hypothesis, and then you, your scientific method, and you quantify all kinds of things. Fundamental things of all kinds at the same time. And um, you put the things together, and you know, you, 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 your quantifications become dimensions in both time, space, as well as, you know, immediate sort of structural presence, you know, architectural sort of platform. And so uh, quant quantifying them, and then it's, after you do that, it's, it's mainly a, a, an objective of identifying proper components. So this is both, you know, sociological, these, these small elements that, that make, you know, things smooth, like the the world, the world smooth without any um, lumps over the great divide. So your your, your threads, your social fabric, the fiber um, that is that is quantifiably strong. So you're pulling these threads. You're lifting the economy basically by pulling these threads. And then, so that's like the future. Uh, how how we manifest. social ecology or structural ecology. So um, yeah, uh, you know, the, the real estate bubble, for instance, it's really about habitation, right? And, <clears throat> and, uh, and, you know, where, where that habitat is, is very important. Uh, and so then uh, transportation and navigation and so basically pollution, a lot of people don't think pollution is a problem, you just roll up the window and the pollution goes away, and it stays in there or something, who knows. Uh, but if you can control the, the navigation and the pollution simultaneously, you have a clear path to pragmatic cultural society. Uh, so, um, where am I? Okay, so like with pollution with, and transportation, uh, beyond just the future of, of where you're going, you also have the sort of chaos of 
it was running amok, you know, just by um, having uh, little little controls that that prevent. Because basically, in the landscape, there is anxiety. Uh, it could be that socio-cultural aspect, but it's also possibilities to pollute and not care not make the connection between, you know, your health and sort of pollution. And so, uh, like controls, imagine you have a control on, a, on an accelerator, and this is automatically activated in certain areas. And so therefore, you're not able to, you know, throttle the, uh, the public. And it's a sort of a degenerate in the gas pedal, and it's proven that you're uh, a degenerate, you know, trying to do it to them or something like that. So you have these like controls that automatically set as you pass a certain point. You uh, you have something that would automatically set a control on on the throttle, so people could not pollute in the elevator. Um, Okay, so if you if you were to override that, those controls, then you would be easily identifiable as someone who who is sort of uh, that word um, deviant, you know, who is you know saying, oh, I'm going to break the rules, the rules that keep everything running smoothly, and so that then you could be <laughs> you could identify those people very easily because. They would be the minority, the extreme minority, who are breaking the rules on purpose. And, um, you know, help them solve their problems, which could very well be that distant sort of cultural problem that is not navigated in uh, cultural normative values, the social ecology, so that why, why would people act uh, thoughtlessly, it's because in the past, the future sense of the cultural geography, there was not the consideration and not the, the solution to find that tiny percentage who, who causes the anxiety in the first place, not not uh, reactively, but, but actively neglected, okay, so actively neglected. Um, and so, so I've talked about this about the, the scales of justice. There are actually in this, this unified social model two beings on this, you know, this big sort of unified social theory. And so the two beings, um, one of them you don't you don't really want to see it. So there's basically a mirror there, so that you're constantly looking down. It is there. It's just um, to see it, you know, thinking about it makes you crazy. So you look at the two, the main two uh, beings, the theoretic ones, the philosophical ones, and they are basically the bottom of the sociology, trying to find people who are stuck in limbo there, and those are these active um, causes in need of, uh, what's the word, uh, the social control theory, there's some words there, there's four points there, you can look, look this up on uh, social control theory, Wikipedia. So you have, you have, um, you're preventing those, those people from getting stuck in limbo in the, in the passage of life as you sort of go forward and stuff like that. And now on the other side, there's the tower of power, all this engineering, all these, you know, uh, new models and stuff like that, always something fancy, um, but not necessarily functional in the balance of the realities and fantasies of the world, you know, the fantasy time of power and all that. Okay, so, um, um, how is this, um, yeah, so basically balancing these two out requires basically theory, basic theory, not complex theory, but there are, it's your salt, with the basic, you're solving the complex before the complicated reaction that is that, that point 
that is um, in, the, in the present, future, uh, or past, future reactions uh, where, that you don't want to see. You, know, you, you want to like, see the mirror. So instead, what you, what you end up seeing, because theory is difficult to to persuade without people thinking you're crazy, right? Um, so, um, yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm trying to do this in some sort of academic situation um, where, you know, you're, you're, you're uh, designing or the or the policy, cultural policy craft of, of the, the past, future geography. And you're also designing basically ex uh, engineering products from existing components. This is important because we don't want to just keep on, you know, there's always so much that's, that's needed, and then you get into a, you know, um, a more degenerative technology and stuff like that, whereas it's not going to make you happy, it's just going to make you a little bit, you know, anxious and stuff like that. Uh, technology, meaning engineering technology, but also potentially electronic technology as using the internet. Um, so yeah, so... And so this is, you know, it's, um, engine, uh, now theory is so difficult to, to prove, you know, it's so, it's so subjective, but it's, um, fundamental, okay, to crack these codes and not make it some sort of political sort of, aha, you know, I found uh, your weakness, and don't, you can't just find it, this is the quantum qualification, you know, you see it, and then you test it, and so, it's like a, like a human a sociological laboratory of civility, finding, finding those threads that do the, per the function that we want them to do, the formula. Okay, so, uh, 12 minutes. <laughs> Who knows who's watching this? But, uh, um, I'm, uh, I've been studying this for a long, 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 long time. And I want to basically somehow deliver the, the theory and the the future, but not insulting the past, okay, so it's not, it's, you know, if you solve, solve the present, and therefore the future, with, with uh, you know, the qualifications of the quantum, and seeing, seeing the present, understanding how, how it can actually work in the future, and how, you know, without the, the strong fibers, yeah. Uh, I'm listening to the radio side. So, you know. Um uh so it's it's very it's very uh it's very good. It's very good. And I'm just trying to um to make it happen, okay? Science, real science and philosoph philosophical um filters. This is this is the future, and uh, that's what I want to help do, you know, basically volunteering and this stuff, uh, because my past, I never realized any opportunities in California, you know, the, the left-hand side of America, um, straight, very, you know, uh, normal. This is, uh, this is a problem, so I, all I can realize is the future, <laughs> okay?
things. <laughs> but, um, oh, I'll make it public. Yeah, I try to make my songs usable by the public. I don't know if I can become a rock star or anything, I guess. But, um, yeah. Okay, so thanks.